Hey everybody! Hey, more Get a Room Man. More Get a Room Man. One of the best games ever made. Well, I wouldn't go that far. One of the best games. Wait, no. Wait, what did one I do? One of the. I don't know. One of the games ever made. Because it was it um it was made. Uh, that's yours. Click it. Do it. Load complete. complete. You're good. All right. There we go. All right. So. Not the best way to start off the episode. Great way to start. I think I just um, tuned out for a while there. But uh, I beat Pantus, beat Big O, beat yeah, the Mojo the Mojo Rumble Mojo Beach. King B. I have to say, okay, so I was playing this on my own the other day, just for the fun of it. Mm -hmm. And uh, go ahead and play. I'll tell the right. story. Um, but I was playing against the uh, the second guy, the uh, Big O. Mm -hmm. And so I was like, I'm going to try it on the regular mode. And then I was like, you know what? I'm going to try it on master mode now. You would not believe the freaking difficulty jump from the regular to the master mode on that song. Probably on all the songs, really, but yep. still, it was just insane. Well, except for, like, the first one. The first one was just fun. Like, when it was on the easy mode, I, I beat it, like, easy. I mean, it wasn't hard at all, but... When I did it on master mode, I fail after like a minute and a half of the song. If I even make it that far. Woofer amazing. Woofer amazing. Is he a dog? It's or is he just like a subwoofer? No. Oh, jeez. It's Puma's stupid spaceship. That's what it's named. Woofer amazing. Why does Puma have a spaceship? I don't know. Why can Puma transform into a... I don't know. Puma can either transform... That's an eyeball. Well, okay, Puma, tr Puma transforming into an amp. I get that. No, I think I can the see... amp is his normal form when he transforms into a dog. I don't know. No, it's explained <laughs> later what's actually going on. You gotta do this. You gotta do it good. Look at that. Boom. Oh, jeez. That sounds kind of spooky. Woo! These are goals. Dang it. Oh, well, I'm here. You suck so much. Oh, gotta, gotta, gotta fight. Yeah, fight it. Wait, did you not? No, there's like a whole bunch of shark sequences in this oh, okay. one. Like Dodge it all. Three, I think. Is, it, is this Doctor Who? Is that what's going on here? It kind of sounds like the... You know, you know? Yeah, I get that. Wow. You're just doing terrible. Sorry, you whistling drumming off on me. It's the ghost level. The ghosts in space. Space ghost, coast to coast. I remember that show. Space ghost, coast to coast. It was a talk show. That was actually a legitimate show? Yeah, space ghost. What does a space ghost do? I don't know, he hosts a talk show with like a giant praying mantis and a... But what does he haunt? Stars? No, he's not... You never watched Space Ghost growing up. No. Does he haunt aliens? No, he's like a superhero. Ghosts aren't superheroes. You've never seen Danny Phantom, I take it. Damn it. You're so bad. <laughs> it's not my fault, I just hate this song. <laughs> I'm not paying attention to him. I'm just desperately thinking about how Danny Phantom's gonna catch them all. Yeah, um... Gotta catch all cause he's Danny Phantom, gotta catch them all cause he's Danny Phantom, gotta catch them all cause he's Danny Phantom. Pokemon! <laughs> Digimon! No, um... Okay, but back to the point. Um, I have actually never watched an episode of Danny Phantom, but I do know the premise, so I feel oh, kind I of dumb for saying so that. much. But, um... I have all of Danny Phantom. We should watch that. I, we should watch that. I wouldn't mind seeing Danny Phantom. I've just never... It wasn't that I didn't, like... It's not that I'm like, oh, this show's stupid. I'm not gonna watch it. It was more or less like... I just never caught the show while it was on. Wow, you were sucking it up hardcore. So, uh, also... We have another game in store pretty soon. Yeah, oh, yeah, uh, you guys are gonna like it. That's, uh, I started playing the other day, and... God, why? 
like, the likelihood of us rage quitting this game is very high. Like, it's easily 70% of us legitimately just saying no, we're done, and, and stopping We're not going to tell you what it is, you'll just have to see it. You'll see it when Zach, pretty sure Zach's Yes, I, I, will, I will be playing this one, because yeah. uh, Jack refuses. I refuse to play this. I should be refusing to play it, but uh, I, 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 I don't know, I just, I think it's something that needs to be seen, us playing it, that is. Like, the game itself doesn't need to be seen, I guess. It's just easily one of the uh, weirder games I've played. And maybe it's not that it sucks, maybe I'm just bad at it. I think it's just the game it sucks. sucks. I'm pretty sure it sucks. Yeah, and I'll say, yeah, I don't think, even, like, no one can be this bad. And, uh, I don't know, for that one, depending on how well it goes, um... I just realized something. But, um... Where those uh, discs are placed on his chest, in order for him to attack you, he has to rub his nipples. <laughs> That's how he attacks. Oh. I wish I had a joke for that, but I don't. <laughs> that is the joke in itself. <laughs> and it's a pretty efficient way to attack somebody, I would say. I would not want to fight a guy who's rubbing his nipples at me. Well, what if he's a giant robot? Uh, even more so, I wouldn't want to fight him. He's a giant robot. He could kill me. Well, if he's a giant shark space robot. I'm afraid of sharks. So I think you know your answer. Everyone's afraid of sharks, Zach. <laughs> I don't think if it's, I've ever met it's someone not really a phobia. Afraid. It's more or less common sense. Yeah, it's kind of like, no one's like afraid of bears. It's just, no one wants to be eaten alive. So you kidding me? Afraid. I'm afraid of bears. Okay. Actually, no, I love bears. Bears are my favorite animal. Well, yeah, but if I saw it out in the wild, I would be like, oh, it's so cool, I'm gonna try and pet it, and be like, oh, this is how I die. No, I'm not gonna go up and touch a bear in the wild. I'm trying my hardest not to mumble and speak louder, because I've noticed in some of our other videos that it's actually really hard to understand what I'm saying. Yeah. Sometimes. And I think it's just because I'm trying too hard to be quiet, because I'm afraid that, like, somebody's yeah. gonna hear me in the other room. But I don't care anymore. I think is how. I mean, when you listen to this music, it sounds like some like Rastafarian stupid music. Not that all Rastafarian music is stupid, just that this music, this song is stupid. Jack, you're going. We're gonna lose all of our Rastafarian music listening to fans. No, I'm not saying that Rastafarian music is bad. It's bad Rastafarian music is bad. And I think it's great that they paired it up with space. I have no idea what Rastafarian music is. To be totally honest. Well, it kind of sounds like this. Not really. Woo! Wait, what am I doing? Um... You... <laughs> well, he rubs his nipples and you pelvic thrust your way to victory. Daddy! <laughs> Daddy! <laughs> Gotta spank his big robot ass. Yeah. Rank, what'd you get? I bet it's a C, or a B, or D. I bet it's not an A. It's a B, I was right. <laughs> when you pick 75, when you pick like 15% of the choices, I'll get the number eventually. Then, you know, you're very likely to win a bet. That is. You know what? This episode's, this episode's almost over, Jack. I think we should just slowly and calmly just save the game and like think back and reflect upon what just oh god okay cutscene cutscene and guess what oh of that evil dirigible oh my gosh it's a blimp that's the big bad by the way whoa prince zoe look at that hair dude it's like something straight up out of dragon ball z minus the horns is there a character in Dragon Ball Z with horns? Yes, the devil. Wait, he has two sets of horns. How evil he is. He's so evil he's got four horns. Infinity <laughs> <laughs> Impossible. Shut up, cat. Infinity Impossible. I feel like the wings on his hat are just the best. They are. That helmet's amazing. Oh, they're very two-dimensional in that. 
shot. Oh, that car's high as shit. <laughs> oh no, we're at Oh no, we're at we're at Staryu Island. Because he's got Staryu from Pokemon. He's got like a little yes. thing in his chest, and that's got like the mountain in the middle. That thing just crashed like directly a star into the water. Oh, my favorite song, or one of them at least, is coming up. And the, oh, no, Zane it's Pico. a woman. It's a lady, though. She got red hair. Okay, by the way, that's his guitar when it's not awesome and like having 36 keys. It looks like an acoustic guitar. It looks just like a regular acoustic guitar. You see, it does It goes through. Oh, but awesome it's got like old buttons on it. <laughs> I like how I do like how the fact that the guitar is essentially a keytar because it's got like buttons and it's got like a little strum thing right here. Like you gold. gotta play it with your spirit, Zach. You gotta play it with your spirit, which you express through your fingers. Well, I'm not saying that it's a bad thing. I'm just saying I like how it looks like a guitar. Also, for a second there, he wasn't even strumming on the thing. Eh, sometimes you just stop strumming. You gotta let you, you feel and speak for themselves. Sometimes you just gotta load. Look how adorable she is. Uh, I guess, is there another cutscene after this, or can I no, end good. the episode? Alright. Okay. See you Bye! Next time. What? Chinway. I mean, to talk to somebody. Like, you had somebody. Look at this bear just punching this bear. Like, you had somebody have a chinway.